tonight we're getting a bird's eye view of the damage Hurricane Hannah left behind. Our Zeth Kovar took his camera up in a helicopter today. Take a look. From high above the coastal bend, Hurricane Hannah's wrath is clear. We begin with a landmark. I saw the on the news ball up here and all that. That was pretty damaging that he did. Planks and sections of railing are gone, likely forcing fishermen and Michael May's customers to find somewhere else to go. Other piers took a pounding too, and the proof is in all of the wood washed up on shorelines. And check out the marina at the Marina del Sol condominium complex. Hannah turned it into a heap of boats and broken wood. Back on the ground, city and private workers are starting the very long task of cleaning up all that debris we showed you. They certainly have their work cut out for them. Now let's get back to the chopper. Just before reaching Bob Hall Pier, our flight path took us over this boat, half sunken and leaking what looks like oil or gas. There was less serious damage, a broken tree here, a flipped over lifeguard stand there, and there's also something we're quite used to seeing, a flooded North Beach. Something that there wasn't reports so far of anyone getting hurt or killed. Just some, you know, branches off the trees. We were very fortunate. We didn't have any flooding. Uh, so, you know, I think Corp is very fortunate. Fortunate this time and hopefully the next because you know there will be another one. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Seth Kovar, Chris 6 News. All right, thanks so much, Seth.